going on, everybody? It's Mel DFS coming to you live and direct. Hit again, my favorite place for today. We got a nine game main slate. Hope everybody's having a great day. If you like the video, please subscribe to the channel. Press that bell icon to always stay notified for new videos. Let's get to these plays. Y'all go on my first pick at point guard. Alonzo Ball at 7,600 on both platforms going against his former squad in which he's averaging 37.4 fantasy points, around 14 points in the past five games. Lakers allowing an average 38.5 fantasy points to the starting point guards. He did have a 53 fantasy point game last go around against the Lakers in November, so a good spot. No Levine should bump up his usage and also positive differential in this spot for today. So I like this play for Alonzo Ball at point guard. Going for a savings play, he should be low on Trey Burke. 3,800 on DraftKings, he's 43 on FanDuel. Just like this price tag overall, averaging 15.2 fantasy points in the past five. In Minnesota, their bottom tier against the point guard reserves, averaging 22.5 minutes in the past two games. So something to consider for Trey Burke with the depleted team, with, as you can see, getting the minutes, and he had 22, 37 in the last two games. So like this play for Trey Burke to dominate, and he's great value for today. Go to our next play, going to our shooting guards. We'll look at Desmond Bain at 6,100 on DraftKings. He has 64 on Fandle going against Portland. He was averaging 33.7 fantasy points in the past five, around 18 points a game, 24% in usage. Portland allows an average 28.7 fantasy points to the starting shooting guards. But of course, without CJ McCullum, should help him in the spot here. He's averaging 34 fantasy points in the past two games versus Portland this season. So like Desmond Bain to consider for your lines for today. Let's go to our next play, go to our small forwards. Let's go to our next play, Duncan Robinson at 46 on both platforms. Again, the team is depleted, Hero is questionable for today, and he's having an up-down trend lately. Check him out, he had 33, 18, 39, 17. So, like this play, we bounce back to the 30 plus and averaging 25.6 fans points in the past five away games. And Detroit's allowing an average 31.4 fans points to the starting small forwards. Like this play for Duncan Robinson for today. Let's go to our next play, going to our small forwards. Cal Anderson at 51 on DraftKings, 57 on FanDuel. He's also another play where I feel like every other game they're increasing his minutes. Check him out with his scoring section. He had 15 minutes, 22, 30 minutes, 37, 18, 25, 27, 41, 19, 23. So I'm looking at 20 plus once again to give you that 30 to 40 plus in this play. As he's averaging 26.2 fantasy points a game, 8 points, 5 rebounds a game. And Portland is bottom tier against reserves. I like this play for Kyle Anderson for value for today. Next play, going to our power forwards. The DeMar DeRozan, 94 on DraftKings. He's cheaper play on FanDuel, 8,500 going against the Lakers. Had a 54 fantasy point game last go around against the Lakers as well in November. Well, Levine, he also gets a positive differential and bump. Um, averaging 42 fantasy points in the past five games, 28 points, 29% in usage. Lakers allow an average 33.8 fantasy points to the starting power force to DeMar DeRozan. Great play that you want to pay up at this price tag. I go to our last play, going to our centers. DeAndre Aiden at 82 on DraftKings, AK on FanDuel. Going against Charlotte, they allow average 31.8 fantasy points to the starting centers. He is averaging 33 fantasy points in the past two games last season going against them. He is averaging 38.3 fantasy points in the past five games. Averaging 19 points, 10 rebounds a game. I like this play for DeAndre Aiden for today. And also looking for value, Dwayne Deadman at 5,100 on DraftKings, 6K on FanDuel. Going against Detroit is he's also uptrend spot. Detroit allows average 32.8 to the starting centers in the past five games. 29.5 fans points to the starting centers in general. Averaging 27.7 fans points in the past five. 11 points, nine rebounds a game. So Dwayne Deadman in a great spot to do work so this is my favorite plays for today if you like the plays give a thumbs up any questions comment below using draft dashboard tools in the link in my description you want to sign up it is a dollar up to 30 days when you sign up get access to the nba cheat sheet you sleep for single studs click on the watch players get my plays up top for watch mills dfs picks be the draft kings or a fan duel so i love y'all y'all collect that bag it's metal dfs and y'all stay blessed and i see y'all in the next video